<laughs> Good evening, everyone. Nice. Answer. Good evening, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's the pre-party stream. <laughs> it's the pre-party stream. I hope everyone is having a good day. I hope everybody's having a good day. Let's hit that. Okay, great. I hope you guys are having a good day so far. Good even, good even, good even. It is Thursday the 11th, and it's Sammy Superstar's birthday. It is Sammy Superstar's birthday today. Um, I hope Sammy jumps in tonight. Then we can wish him happy birthday when he comes to the stream. Please, please. So good evening and welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, my screen then went out. My screen then went out. Give me a second, guys. Once I get situated. Once I get situated. So welcome. I'm gonna stay how I want it to stay. All right, that's better. That is better. That's better. That's better. Welcome and good evening, everyone. It is the pre-party stream. We are going to party next week. And <coughs> <coughs> I hope to have you guys all in the house. I hope to have everyone in the house. Because I would not be able to have a, be having this party on here if it wasn't for you guys. So I do not want to party by myself. So I hope I will see everybody there. If you guys can hear me, please. Hit that number one. If you guys can hear me, if you guys can see me okay, and um, hit that number one, please, and thank you. And welcome, welcome, welcome. If you guys have not already known, my channel name is no longer Inspirational Connection TV. It's Samantha Just Inspired. So on this channel, Samantha Just Inspires, Motivate, and Encourage, and Builds Confidence, okay? with using words of affirmation from the words of affirmation jar and also the inspirational jar, which is inspirational content as well. So please do me a favor, guys, if you have not done that already and drop a comment, okay, in the chat, share this live stream. Um, and also remember, to hit that like button as well as you jump in the chat just so that everybody know that I'm talking I'm saying something that makes sense right I'm saying something that makes sense and for my replay viewers that come and watch the stream after please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because if you don't do that then you won't be able to know when I go live you won't be able to be in the chat to talk to me and be physically there when I'm doing my live stream. And then you'll miss all the motivational content and the inspirational live streams with me. Okay? So please, replayers, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you will not miss when I come on here. Okay? And, of course, I want to thank everyone, all of you, that has been rocking with me this far that has been coming into my streams and loving the confetti, loving what I do. And you guys are coming back week after week. I don't think I've missed a stream in a while. Week after week, coming back and checking me out. And I just wanna thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. Um, if it has not been for you guys, I would not be here. I would not be still doing this YouTube thing. Okay, I will be otherwise minded, but thank you, thank you, thank you. You get confetti, everybody gets confetti. And, of course, you guys deserve a round of applause. So, please, please give yourself a round of applause, a pat on the back. And know that it's because of you why I come back every week, okay? There are some days where I just want to sleep. 
<laughs> I just want to sleep when I come back because I miss you guys and I want to talk to you guys and, and connect with you guys. So tonight we're going to talk about here and now, how I made it. How did I make it? Okay, how did I make it from everything that we talked about so far and so now, how did I make it to where I'm at tonight? Okay, so tonight's stream is going to be all things Samantha. My birthday is in how many days, guys? CJ, do the math for me. I know you're in the chat. Do the math. My birthday is how many days now? So we're going to still talk about things. And then after that, I'm done talking about me. Okay, I'm not talking about me no more. After Monday, you guys don't ask me no more questions about my life. <laughs> um, just kidding. But... All things Samantha tonight. So we'll talk about a poll question. There was a poll question that we missed last week. And I think there's another one today or yesterday. And then um, we'll get into the, we're going to first do our affirmation, of course. And then we'll get into the content and we'll just chit chat a little bit and um, talk with you guys and see what you guys are doing and how you guys they've been. And after that, we'll talk a little bit more about the birthday celebration and let you guys know what, how it's going to go down. And I would love to see everyone here on Monday, sometime throughout Monday. It doesn't have to be from 8.30 till 10, 30, 12 o'clock. But if you pop in and out, that is okay as well. Okay? So let's jump in the chat and see who is here in the house. And then we will get started. Uh, so, of course, Haley's here. Haley's like, hey, mommy. Like she's like, hey, mom, I'm in the house, mommy. I'm watching you, mommy. And the poll is there. And my mother, of course. Hey, beautiful lady. Hello, beautiful lady. And welcome to the party stream. And grandma's saying hello, Haley. And Wayne is in the house. Good evening, Wayne. Good to have you. Good to have you in the house. Um, we're definitely gonna party. We are definitely going to party. I hope you enjoyed your birthday as well. I hope you I know your birthday was on Tuesday, so I hope you had a good birthday. Um, and did some cool stuff. So, um, I'm definitely gonna try to turn down, <laughs> not turn up, but I want to have a good birthday too this this year around. And Ash is in the house saying good evening to everyone. Good to have you, Ash. Haley saying hi. <clears throat> Wait. <clears throat> Ash, am I coming down with with something? Can you guys see like all my? Yeah, you guys probably can. No filter tonight, guys. No filter tonight. Um. CJ says hi. He's streaming. I know CJ streaming, and I actually logged in, and you know me, Ash. I got like CJ stream. I'm trying to jump into CJ stream on the other end. <laughs> wow, my stream is going on. Um, I know he's doing. I know he's doing a stream too tonight. Um, I hope it doesn't like give me no loud noise when I go click on it. But I know he's doing a stream. I'm gonna have to quickly do this and mute it. Filled with a sugary non-egg sauce. I know he's doing a stream as well. Okay. So I know he's doing that. And Haley's saying hello. Um, you can hear me good. Thanks, Ash. And CJ's jumping on here too, saying hello. I am doing well, CJ. I hope you are doing great. I hope you are well as well. I hope you are doing much better today. Okay. Her. And so he's still in here. He's in the chat. I won't be here. Just stopping by and say hi. I know CJ. I'll try. I'll try on Monday, but I'm on pretty strict doctor's orders right now. Laugh a lot. I'm literally told to be quiet. Haha. <laughs> it's how my vocal cords recover. Um, that's fine, Ash. Um, that is perfectly fine. We'll talk. So guys, so let's get into, let's get into it tonight. So I won't keep you guys late tonight because next week, Monday, we're going to be here till midnight, at least till midnight. Well, hopefully I'll stay here till midnight. Not hopefully, I need sleep, but midnight should be, should be just right. So let's get everything together. 
I think I said hello to everyone. Didn't skip anyone. I'm always good for skipping people in the chat. But I did hit everyone that's on. And if you're on, please say hello. I would love to acknowledge you when you come into my stream. Um, to say hello and um, put your comments on the screen and welcome you, especially if it's your first time. If it's your first time watching my live stream and you've never been in here before, please just say hello or say hi, Sam, and so that I can acknowledge you and um, say hello to you, okay? Oh, talk about that. I need to get to Sammy because I need some music. Ash, do you have any ideas of what I can do to, because I do not want to get kicked out of YouTube, but I need some music, like some really good music to play on Monday, create a playlist or something, I don't know, but do something um, so I can have some music playing for next week, Monday, I'm going to talk to my brother too, because maybe he can just play, create, do something for me, I don't know, or yeah, I need to get some music, okay, so how many, let's see how many is in the chat. Okay, how many should I, I'm going to do six. Six affirmations tonight. I'm going to do six. One, two, three, four. Oh, my fingers stuck. Five and six. We're going to do six tonight. Six affirmations tonight. Because I need to have some type of music um, next week. So I got to figure that out. I told you today it was stressful, right? Ash, I got to figure out music. Um, I got to figure out music next for next week. So let's do six affirmation. Then we can just get talking. Uh, why do I still have this in my ear? I'm done with that. Okay. You use epidemic sound and it has to be paid. Ooh, what is going on? Uh, epidemic sound, but it has to be paid for. Okay, I'm going to figure that out. I got to figure that out. Okay, let's get into it. So affirmations, affirmation, affirmation, affirmation. Now you guys know Samantha love affirmations, right? Um, right, you guys know that I love affirmations on my channel. Um, it's what I do mostly every, every, every stream. Right, it helps you to overcome negative thoughts and repeating them often enough and believing in them also allows you to make positive changes in your life. Right, we know that they're essentials for your daily life because it helps you release that fear, worry, anxiety, whatever it is that you're going through. We know that it helps when you use that by speaking it with power, authority over your life and commanding it throughout your day. We know that it, it, it gives you that power to feel better about whatever it is you're going through, to feel stronger, to feel, turn this on, to feel like you can overcome those obstacles that you are going through. So using them daily and repeating them, look yourself in the mirror as well and say them over your life daily. Um, it will make a difference, okay? So this one says, I am special. The first one for tonight, and we're gonna do six, is I am special. I am special. The second one tonight is, I am brilliant. I am brilliant. I am brilliant. And the third one is, oh, this third one, we're gonna do this one last. This one doesn't have any, words on there this one just says i am so you can fill this with any word that you would like you can fill it with any word that you would like for that one that one is a empty one we'll do that one last i'll do that one after i finish the rest of these um uh, uh oh one of them fell one second and remember i always tell you guys you guys can use your own you guys don't have to use the ones that i do you guys can pick whatever word Whatever positive word that um, you need at that moment, you can use any one of those words, okay? Um, so the fourth one is, I am genuine. I am genuine. I am genuine. And then you have, next one is, I am healed, Ash. 
I am healed. 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 I was trying to see if it'll, it'll do what it's supposed to do, but it does it and then it stops. Okay. And then this one says, I am rare. I am rare. Okay, so we're going to go to the empty one. And the empty one said, I am. So we're just going to pull some words out, right? So you want to look yourself in the mirror and whatever you're going through that day. So you'll say something like, I am amazing. I am strong, right? I'm amazing. I am strong. I am unique. I am intelligent. I am well able, right? You just say words, whatever you're going through, I am grateful, right? I am, um, I'll give you another one. And you just use the words, whatever you're going through, I'm an overcomer. I am gorgeous. I am beautiful. I am um, anointed. I am authentic. All those good, positive words. Uh, one of my posts that I did this week was to, and I should have read that. One of my posts that I did this week was for, um, was for you to put a name, put a, take a letter out of my name and do a positive word, right? A positive word of my name. And I got some really, really good ones. Some super duper nice ones. I'm going to actually try to jump into and read a few of them because I really got one that I really, really, really was happy with. Um, it's not happy with, but you know, it was really nice. Um, I don't even know how to find it, guys. Hold on. Like Instagram, Instagram. So I posted it on all my social media accounts. And, um, and okay, so this is not gonna work. You know me, I don't know what, I don't know how to get to social media, this thing on here. Mm -mm, not today, Jesus, not today, okay. We gonna do that another way. We're gonna do this. I'm actually going to mess with you today, Instagram, Instagram. Here it is, okay, found it, okay. <sighs> What? Sorry, guys. Okay, what did you say, Mom? He is where? Hold on. I'm trying to read some of the ones that I had this week. Okay, there it goes. Got it. So I had a few people that responded to it. And forget it. I'm going to tell you guys what they said. Hey, they bring my iPad. Thanks, baby girl. Let's see. I am healed. Eventually, you're healed now, Ash. You have to speak that into existence. You have to speak it like it's happening. You will be healed. You are healed. Let's see. Okay. So I had a few, and I'm going to just read a few. Um, and I love when people participate. It's good to participate. I told you guys, you have to participate because I have some surprises and things. I can't even find my Instagram. Okay, there it goes. Okay. So on a few of them, if I could remember. Okay, on a few few people posted and I'm going to tell you how many I got. So one person said, uh, I'm super for S. Anna says, uh, I'm not going to say it's adorable appreciation um and one person said they did my entire first name okay special anointed motivated artistic noble truthful honorable and awesome and i was like yeah you hit it right on the nail special anointed motivating artistic noble truthful honorable and awesome and I was like, that is so nice that um, they did my entire name. And then there's somebody else on, on YouTube did that as well. Look at that. Somebody else on YouTube did that as well. I'm going to read that one as well. Um, you guys got to participate. You participate. Somebody else did that on YouTube. Let's see who it was. Yeah. Okay. So here it goes. So 
self-confidence, adorable, magnificent, amazing, neighborly, talented, hospitable, ambitious, right? And Wade also chimed in and he was, he said, awesome. Robert chimed in and Robert was like, amazing. I think somebody else on it, but I can't see everything the way I'm looking at it. So use po those positive words. They are so, um, and I mean, you know, you never know what you're going through and you may want to um, read one depending on what you're doing or, or what's happening in your life at that time. So use those words, say it, I am off. And you can even do words for your name, acronym your name as well, and say those words and even put it on something and keep it on like your wall or something so you can always go back and um, reflect on reflect on it, right? And always repeat it. So um, let's see. So I'm gorgeous, I'm grateful, I'm strong, I'm well able. Just use them with power and command it over your life, okay? It works, it works, okay? Let's see what she said. Mom says, Wayne is at the Miami Dolphins game. That is right, with his uncle, who is being honored for his 24 years of service in the United States Marine Corps. That is right, Delwyn Ellington is his name. Delwyn Ellington is his name, and he's being honored tonight um, at the Miami Dolphins game for serving 24 years in the service um, of the Marine Corps. And he is the sergeant as well. He is the sergeant as well. So that is really dope um, that he's being honored for that. So big up to Delwyn Ellington for that great, great, great accomplishment. Okay, so let's get into it tonight. Let's get so next week. Let's talk about that. So next week, 8:30, Monday night. We're gonna be right here, same place, same time. And at um 8:30. And what I would like, to, I'm gonna do it on StreamYard. So what I'm going to be doing is just posting a link, and then when everyone comes in, whoever wants to jump jump on and wish me happy birthday, I have a few people that are gonna be. That I already know and they're gonna come but if anybody else jumps in and wants to be a part they are welcome to they're welcome to come on and be a part as well I feel like my thing is like turned Gosh, I don't know what is going on. okay they'll be able to come on and wish me happy birthday so let's talk about the content tonight so we talked on last week, Tuesday, about me being born in Jamaica, moving from Jamaica to the United States, um, what I had to deal with, um, being a um, not undocumented little girl, <laughs> and then transitioning over to now, after all of that, and what um, and how I dealt with it, how I made it, basically. How did I make it right? How did I do it? How did I end up where I'm at now? What am I doing now? Where am I now throughout all that situation? How did that turn out for me? And it turned out great. Um, it turned out um, not as expected, but I have no necessarily, I don't have complaints. There's a lot that I still would like to do in terms of um, growth and things like that or being able to do certain things, but Right now, um, I have no nothing that's nothing on my stamping on my paper saying you can't go here, you can't do that. That's not for you. I don't have that anymore. So I'm able to do. I have a business. I've had more than one, honestly. Business, um, a nonprofit. Um, I was able to purchase a home, right? So I'm able to do certain things now. And I had a video about that overcoming obstacles as well. You can check that out. And um, just hear a little bit about all the things that I went through and then how I was still able to overcome those obstacles and roadblocks and things that was in my life that allowed me to still be able to um, obtain the things that I have now. Okay, so one of the things that was really, really good for me was that I was able to travel 
to so many places that I never thought that I would be able to go to. Um, I traveled um, the Caribbean islands. Um, I went to places that I've never even known was there. Morocco. Um, my mom's in the chat. Mom, drop some of the names in the chat um, to some places that we went on that trip. St. Martin. Um, we went to Barbados. We went to St. Croix, St. Kitts. Um, there's one place, the first place that we landed. Drop it in the chat because I do not remember all of them. Okay, do not remember all of them. Went to Hawaii. I think it was a two weeks. Was two weeks was in Hawaii, or or I think it was about two weeks, or like eight days or something like that in Hawaii on a cruise as well. And went to each island in Hawaii. Um, and went into a cave. And I wanted to show those pictures of me being in a cave in Hawaii. And I'm gonna actually pull it up. Um, I'm gonna actually pull it up. Let's see. And I'm gonna show you guys some pictures of me when I was in Hawaii. <laughs> You know it. Um, you know it. Sorry, guys. Let's see if that's going to work. That works. Okay. So, did that. Was able to do, to go back to Jamaica, of course. Talked about that as well. Um, I don't need to get notifications. I just want to go to my pictures. So I'm going to pull this up for you guys and just show you a few pictures. So I wasn't, um, I didn't allow the things that I went through to stop me from doing anything. Once I was able to, once I was able to make that switch or that transition and was in, you know, I was able to go places. I did whatever, um, that I could. And there's still more places I want to go. One of my questions too, my poll questions was, where is my dream vacation? And I don't think anybody got that. And what's my favorite fruit? Nobody got that yet. Um, everybody's picking banana. I love banana, but that is not my favorite fruit. That is not my favorite fruit. It is not banana. Not banana. Not banana. Okay, so... I'm going to show you guys a few pictures of, um, let's see if mom is going to tell me some of the cruises I went on to. So here's, I'm going to actually go through them and show you guys, um, this was one right here. This was in, um, yeah, I know where this was. This was in, uh, Virgin, VI, Vir this was Virgin, um, yeah, Virgin Islands. So give me a second. I'm going to pull up. I want to show you guys the one within the cave. So we went to Hawaii and we went into like this mountain place and it's not mango ash. You are so close. You are so close. Like I do love mangoes. I do love mango ash, but it was not mango. Let's see if I can actually, let me see something. I'm going to show you guys some pictures. So let's just make this fit into this little thing here because I know I didn't plan to to do this tonight, but we're gonna make it work tonight. You're so close, Ashley. You are so close. It scares me. But it's not banana, it's not mango. Okay, I know you guys may not be able to see this picture that well, but this was me in um okay, this was me in St. Martin. Um, so we did a cruise and St. Martin was one of the places that we went to. And let's see, Wayne's in the house. Yes, Wayne, we just talked about um you um being with um with Delwyn being honored at the um the Miami Dolphins game tonight. We just talked about that. I hope you guys are having a good time. So that was um that was St. Martin. Oh, my mom just put some more up. So yes, 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 yes. So B Bermuda, Catries, Grenada. Yes, Grenada. 
um, and St. Martin, and that's St. Martin up there. And then you know St. Martin has a twin sister. It's St. Martin and St. Martin and Martine. It's two of them that's pronounced different. And um, what is the one? St. Bart's. St. Bart's. We went to St. Bart's as well. So I was able to go to different places. Let me tell you, anybody, anybody is able. Nobody is not. Don't ever feel like. You are not able to do the things that you want to do. It doesn't matter what life um, throw your way. Um, and I'm going to show you some Hawaii pictures as well. It doesn't matter what life throw your way. Don't ever think that you're not able to do it. This was me in Hawaii. And I had all my little hula hula thing there too, child. You see that I had? I had my little... This is me. And this is my friend Patience. Oh, God. I don't know who that guy is in the background. Guy, I have no idea who he is. So I hope he doesn't call me and ask me why I put it up there. But that was me in Hawaii. And um, there's another one here. Um, and this was another one of us here as well. Can you guys know? Can you guys see me? You guys can see me? Yep, right here. That's me. Wow, when we were in Hawaii. Places that I never thought that I would go to, right? That I never, you know, you come here and you think, okay, well... You can't even go back to where you were born. So don't think about going anywhere else in the country. Mm, don't tell me that. <laughs> I told you guys that. Don't tell me that. Do not tell me that. Do not tell me the word no. Because that's when I'm going to want to do it the most. Okay. So I'm going to actually jump into the albums. Because I have some really good ones. Here it is. really have some other ones. The one that I really wanted to show you, that's what I'm looking for. Me in the cave. Me in the cave. Jack, what, mom? Okay, look. Oh, I know. I got some good ones. Oh, we got some good ones, mommy. Mommy, do not be mad at me, okay? Please don't be mad at me, but I got some good ones. So this was us in, the, me and my mom, in the captain's. Um, We were actually... Like, I really wanted to drive this thing, but, you know, I couldn't do it. So this was when we were on the cruise. It was a, how many, was it like three weeks, three, three and a half, almost four weeks cruise around the entire um, Caribbean islands. And that was us in the cap, what do they call that again, mom? Like the captain something, right? Literally in where they drive the boat. So like right next, like right behind where we were, the captain was there on his big wheel driving the, the ship, um, the ship that we were on crystal seas i think it was that we we went on um so that was um there and then here's the other one with me and my mom this was in um this one was in this was vi this was virgin islands and let's see if i can find another i'm gonna show you guys another one so this was us on the ship and that is my mother um on the ship at that i don't remember where this was in the middle of the ocean somewhere but that was me and my mom well that was mommy and here's another one she she, she thinking she was something child I'll tell you about these people they get little something look at that look at that look at that look at that and they told us that we couldn't do certain things and yet here we are here we are here we are now this one guys is us in saint kitts <laughs> this is us in St. Kitts and that is my mom and in St. Kitts when you come off the ship like you know your tourism and stuff and you come off the ship there is people that come out and they have their little monkeys I mean they're cute this one had, had on a little diaper <laughs> even a little diaper they had a little diaper <laughs> on this one and my mom was like oh she said get that monkey off my back it was cute. It was a cute little monkey. I would I would have taken one home if I could, honestly. And, you know, if they had the little teddy bear ones that you can take home. I think we did take home two for, um, for my nieces and nephew. But the monkeys were so cute. And she was so afraid to hold the monkey. See, look at this guy. They were so cute. And they were just there coming up to us with the monkeys if we wanted to hold them. And it's like they're little, literal pets, okay? Little, literally pets. Um, there. So that was St. Kitts. Um, and this was another picture of us inside where we're going to dinner inside the cruise ship. Um, you know, every night we dress up and we go down and we have dinner. That was um, another um, night on the cruise. 
So I have traveled. I have traveled. I have I have traveled. I have definitely traveled um to places that I never I never thought I would go to. Um and that is because of my um one, I trusted God to take me to these places, right? I trust him, I trusted him to allow me to get through the situation, to overcome, you know, those roadblocks, those things that people said that I couldn't do. Or, and not people because of people that I know. Just the system, okay? The system is set up to to not allow, you're not from here, you shouldn't be able to do these things. And it wasn't, um, it wasn't, it wasn't it wasn't so um for me. God didn't allow me to sit in that place and um curl up like a you know, a little girl and start crying, Oh my gosh, I can't go. Um I can't go here, I can't do this, I can't have that. I didn't do that. I made sure that I um did what I needed to do, got my situated so that I was able to do the things that I always wanted to do, and that was go travel the world. Guys, I am not like I'm looking at these pictures and I'm like, look at here. I can show you guys these cute pictures with Haley when she was a baby. Hey, Haley when she was a baby, and I'm gonna do it only because I know she's watching. And um, this was the little girl, guys. This was the little girl here. This was the little girl here. You thought she was something. You hear me? She thought she was something. That's her and her grandma. She thought she was something. <laughs> she thought she was something. My cutie pie. She's too cute. 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 Anyways, um, back to cruise pictures. Let me find some more. Let me take you guys off of that. Let me find some more cruise pictures. So you guys can see um i'm looking for the one honestly that i was in the cave mommy i cannot find that one but i know it's on here when we were in the cave and that is the one that i am looking for when we were in hawaii oh so mommy was not the only one that was able to do take a picture like that i have a picture here too okay so this was me on the ship as well And trust me, if you if no one have if you guys have not gone on a sh cruise, like I literally don't like to be on the ship, but it is the most relaxing thing. If you don't have like you know that stomach thing, because I had that, and they had to give me something to take. I had to put the thing on my little um, pulse thing here to make me not like throw up and stuff. But it was it was it was um a good cruise. Let me check some of these um comments out. I'm skipping you guys like you're crazy. You're cute, mommy Jack. Jack, 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 Jack. Yes, Jack. <laughs> too, too cute. Thanks, Ash. Mommy is a captain. <laughs> um, I was trying to be Haley. I was trying to be. Got my rock. You remember that? You little baby munchkin. Um, four weeks. It was four weeks. Four weeks. Um, some four weeks, mom. No, she liked it. It's really cute. <laughs> yes, Haley, your grandma rocks. <laughs> hey, Moni. Good to have you in the house, Moni. I'm just talking about here and now the things that I've done after I was in the situation I was in. And basically the fact that I didn't allow it to stop me. I didn't allow it to stop me from, you know, doing the things that I wanted to do. This was me on a cruise, a four weeks cruise. With my mom, we, we went on the Caribbean islands. Um, and I'm trying to actually find some more. So here's another one. There's a few of them in here. I'm just going to roll through it. There's a few of them in here. So I won't have to keep jumping back and forth. There's a few of them in here. This was me again in the ship. This was me again. And I put it too far. You guys won't be able to see it now. This is me again um, on the ship. And here is another one. And this one was in Bridgetown. Where was Bridgetown, mom? Uh, one week, one week into my cruise and having a great time. Oh, Bridgetown, this was Barbados. And then we went to St. Lucia. 
We went to Barbados, then St. Lucia, St. Kitts, then St. Thomas. I don't remember at the moment. Can't wait to get back home though, missing my phone. Oh, really, Sam? All right. That was, um, this was Barbados. This one was in Barbados. And um, I think this one was Caracal. This one was in Caracal. See, I forgot the, the Facebook literally keeps track of these things because I forgot, I wrote it down. It was Caracal, December. This was December 5th, 2012. Dates, remember, two, December 5th, 2012. I was in, um, we went to um, the cruise. That was in Caracal. I don't remember where this, this Caracal as well. This was Caracal as well. And this was, yep. Welcome to the Ridge Fort, um, established 1828 in Caracal. This was Caracal as well. <laughs> I'm reading the comments and I'm dying over here with laughter. Eight years ago. Oh, eight years ago. Caracal again. All right, and then that's a star tree. You guys don't want to see the star tree. I'm trying to find the one with me in the cave, and I'm going to find it because that one is very beautiful. Even though I was scared out of my mind. It's somewhere in here. I don't remember where, but it's somewhere in here. I've been to a few places. Um, I've been to a lot of states. I've been to Michigan. Of course, I have family in New Jersey. Um been to a lot of different places um that i don't remember now i've been so many places meant tennessee so many places seeing the snow um traveled the world which is what um it's 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 a good thing to get out and and see you know like i, I really would love to go to the philippines i would literally just go just to go see mommy lala just to go meet mommy lala i would go to the philippines Definitely go to the Philippines. Okay, I think I am at the, I'm almost there to find, to find that picture. Okay, here is the Hawaii pictures. I found it, mother dearest. And they're like all in one shot, except for my, my brother came into those, some of the spotlight. So we'll start here. We guys can't see this one that well, but I found them. So here is, us in this was me in Hawaii. I did bar. I remember Barbados. Oh, I came out of it. Hold on, guys. And that was me and my brother, Jr. We were um. I think when we first got there. When we first got to. And you know what's nice about Hawaii? If you guys have ever been there, they have these really big fish, and they're like everywhere. They literally are like everywhere, and they're like all behind us in this picture. All behind us here. These fish were. I was like, let's take a picture of the fish. And of course, Jared was like, of course. And this was in 2010, we were in Hawaii. 2010, we were in Hawaii. Um, then me and my mom again, she thought she was something. Look at her. She thought she was something, dear child. She thought she was something. That was me again. And me and Patience again. Um, oh, this was Jared. We buried Jared in the sand. <laughs> We buried him in the sand. He wanted it, guys. We didn't do it. He really wanted to be buried. Let me take it off of JR. Get, let me get that off of there. And there I go again. Um, almost, uh, yeah. That was me. And this was a night out as well in Hawaii. And my mom. And that's me again on the cruise ship. Me again. And those are the, vo like, we saw volcanoes. Literally, like, volcano literally just when the ship is sailing you can literally see the volcano like right there right there that's my cousin and my mom i'm trying to get to the cave I'm trying to get to the cave sandman for sure <laughs> he sure was he sure was but hawaii was beautiful i will definitely go back again i will definitely go back again i will definitely go back again it was a great trip Guys, there go the fish. I told you about the fish. The fish. They are huge. They are big fish. You ever been to a Chinese restaurant here in the States and you go and like in some of them, they still have it there. They still have, um, they still have like these little mini like 
mini pond or something like in front and like the hibachis and stuff and they have those big fish like in there but the ones in hawaii they were used yes barbados was one of them mom <laughs> barbados was and caraco and caraco let's see if i can find the one with me in the cave and that was a see look how much look at that you guys see those fish behind us like literally and i'm a fish girl august 23rd look I forgot I had this picture. You guys see how many fish? Can you guys see that? Yes, you guys can see it. All of that. Yeah. They were, so look what I wrote. This is from 2010, guys. 2010, um, August 23rd. Um, look at all the fish that were everywhere. They were everywhere. Literally, like a, like, full of fish i don't know what i was doing guys i don't know see and look there's a fish i think this place that we stayed at like they just enjoyed fish or something because that was a big fish too oh i remember this we went to we took pictures one day and we were standing on like the big rocks and a wave one thing i did not know about hawaii is that they have the biggest waves if you can't swim do not go to Hawaii. I almost drowned like twice. Literally fell into a hole one time. And then the second time, my brother told me to go do some boogie board thing. And I literally, yeah, literally not again. Not again. And there was so much waves, so much waves. See, that was me and my mom. And the way literally we were jumping, we were trying to take pictures. And the waves was so strong. <laughs> Look at my mom. <laughs> It was so strong. We didn't even know that it was going to be so strong. We were literally like standing on top of rocks, but that's how high the waves were. If you've never been to Hawaii, please, please, please let it be a vacation spot. Let it be a vacation spot because it was awesome. And there goes my little brother telling me to go on this thing. I did it and it took me all the way out and I cannot swim. Can't swim. Can't swim. Can't swim that great. And this was us in the submarine. We went into a sub, we did excursions as well. So we went into the submarine and went all the way to the bottom of the ocean. Went to the bottom, 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 bottom of the boat. Bottom of the boat. This was fun. It was scary at first. Okay, you guys can't see the picture, but this was the cave. That I was telling you guys about. And that's my brother right here inside of the cave. I think there's another picture. Oh, wow. That's me with some pretty flowers. I'm always taking pictures about pretty flowers. That's me again. This was still Hawaii. This was Hawaii, Hawaii, Hawaii. And there's me and mom again. We finally got it right. We finally got the picture right. All right. I'm trying to find the cave. Oh. I remember this guy when we went to eat dinner one night he came over he was giving us joke that was the chef on the ship in Hawaii and this was another this I think this, he was just a waiter or something really cool and she didn't order anything for her <laughs> her dessert and that was the ship that we took that we, it was queen of yeah um the pride of America pride of America was the sh cruise ship that we were on and this, guys, I told you about the volcano. See the volcano? That was the volcano. Literally ruptured. I was like, well, let's go. Time to go. There's that ocean. Here I am in the cave. I told you guys I was in the cave. See? <laughs> that was me in the cave. Literally, I didn't want to go no further. I was scared just being at the beginning of that cave. Just being right there, I was scared. But that was us in the cave. That was us in the cave. It was a scary, scary, scary cave. This was Hawaii pictures, guys. Um, and I had some cruise pictures, but not as much. I already showed you guys this one. Me back into. Ooh, you guys don't want to see Trey Songs? Oh Lord Jesus, that was Trey Songs. I need to click that out of there. <laughs> okay, so um, I traveled and I went a lot of um, I went to a lot of places. Um, a lot of them I don't remember because it's been so long, but I'm grateful for the fact that even though I went through the things that I went through, I was, you know, undocumented. You can't travel. You can't do this. You can't, you don't even have the proper documents to even do school, complete school. But yet I was able to still 
obtain the things that I needed. Um, right. And then I was able to, I was able to travel and go to places that, you know, people that are born in the States will probably never go. So I'm grateful for that. I, I did it because I trusted in God. I knew that he had a plan for me. He had a plan for my life. He knew that I was going to do something good with what the gifts he gave me. He didn't think that I was just going to, you know, get everything and do nothing. I'm able to give back to my community. I'm able to do things for other people as well. And if I was not able to obtain the status and be where I'm at, I wouldn't be able to do that. So he had a plan and I am grateful for that. And um, this is the picture of us in Jamaica. We've been back in Jamaica so many times after that. I think I've been in Jamaica how many times, mom? 10, 13, there's 10, 14, 10, 15. About five or six times I've been back to Jamaica. Yeah, about five or six times I've been back to Jamaica. Then if it wasn't for COVID, I would have gone back already two times. But because of COVID, um, I have not, um, they haven't gone anywhere out of the country because of that. But just know that doesn't matter what you go through. It doesn't matter what, um, what obstacles you face, what difficulties, what challenges, what obstacles, what roadblocks, anything that may want to stop you from becoming something greater, um, just know that you are able to do do whatever you put your mind to. Nothing can stop you. There's, there's nothing, I said this before. There's nothing in life that if you want to do it, you can't do it. It has to be some, I mean, some serious reason, medical reasons or something like that, why you can't. And even if, if you have some type of medical condition, you're still able to do your, um, the vision and the dreams that you have for yourself, you're still able to accomplish those goals as well. So I was able to make it. I'm here now and I am a citizen of the United States. Been a citizen for uh, over three years, three, four years now. I've been a citizen and um, I've been able to buy my own home. I've been able to have a business. I've been able to travel. I've been able to do so many things. And it's because I remain consistent, faith, consistent, faithful, and trusted in the only person that I knew how to trust in and did the work as well, right? I did the work. I made sure that I, that I was supposed to do, didn't get into trouble, didn't do anything illegal so that I'm able to be something, right? So thank you guys for listening next week. Is going to be some party time for me, okay? I am turning 18 again. <clears throat> 18, I'm gonna be 18 next week. Don't tell anybody, I told you guys. So if anybody's, the last people that's on here, I'm gonna be 18, 18 next week. I would like to have everybody in the house. If I'm 18 and Haley's 80, I'm like, Sammy had a Haley when you were 10. <laughs> So hope to see you guys all in the house um, next week, Thursday, Monday at 8.30. You guys won't see me till then. We're going to definitely have some confetti going. We're going to party like it's 1999 or maybe 1983. Who knows, right? We're going to party. I would love to have you all here to support show some love and i do still i'm still hopeful for my birthday wish thousand subscribers i can get it all tomorrow you never know so i'm looking forward to that so please 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 remember to stop by okay so have a good night everyone i will see you guys next week no you're not 18 yes i am 18 Haley. who told you that she don't know my age age so you guys have a good night and i will see you guys on 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 to monday who told you i'm not 18 i'm gonna be 18 girl i'm gonna be 18 18